Hey, it's Kamori, and today we're going to talk about five ways ironing can improve your cosplay. The first is through using an iron on your patterns. Tissue paper patterns, if they're all scrunched up and wrinkled, can actually be ironed on a very low setting to help smooth the wrinkles out. Just be careful not to accidentally burn your pattern, so test in a small area and use a very low setting. Method number two is ironing your fabric. It's always a good idea to iron fabric before you cut it because if you cut through any wrinkles it can lead to warping and distorting of the pieces that you cut out and then you can end up with an improperly fitting garment. Method number three is to iron your seams. Pressing seams open is a must whenever you are doing any sewing on a project where you can iron the material you're working with. It just leads to a smoother overall look and it also can make the garment fit better. And number four is ironing adhesives. There are a whole bunch of different products that use an iron to heat activate a component of it. For example, heat and bond for appliques or after you're done painting, you can use iron to heat set the paint and this just broadens the horizons of things you can do to add a little bit more detail to your costume. And the fifth way ironing can help improve your cosplay is ironing the costume itself. This is definitely a must if you are planning on entering any sort of cosplay craftsmanship competitions because it really shows that you put the extra effort in to make your costume look presentable before the judges. And those were five ways ironing can improve your cosplay. If there's anything I missed, let me know in the comments below. For more cosplay-related videos, please subscribe, and thank you very much for watching. Bye!